Mal and I had to run some errands today, so we decided to have lunch out at Corbett's, which is a soda and burger place that we've been to a few times before. Very interesting. They got, you know, all of these different sodas there. They have a bunch of different specialty burgers. It's a very, very cool place. Uh, Mao had a, a pretty, I guess, relatively normal burger. It just had cheer wine, barbecue sauce, barbecue sauce on it. And then I had a... Uh, more Hawaiian themed burger because it had the barbecue sauce, bacon, and a grilled pineapple. I actually chose my soda first, which was Kitty Piddle, and it was a pineapple drink. So I, after I had that, I was like, oh, I should get a, uh, a burger that kind of goes with that. And it was good. It was really good. I, you know, we haven't been there in quite a while, and it's a, it's a cool place to go. It's one of the recommendations I've given people that are visiting Raleigh because, like, you can try an interesting soda. Do what? I don't know if we've gone since we first went. I've been more. Th I've been there a few times. Mm. Three times? I don't know. Anyway, hi everyone. Welcome to Tuesday. Um, we are in the garden because it's finally time. It's finally time. It's happening. I think. We. I'm gonna harvest it. We think it's happening. We're not. We're not entirely sure, but so, we think it's happening. store honeydew melons look like the one back there. Yeah. But I cut one open like that, and it wasn't ready. Okay. So I let this next one get this color, and we're yes. going to cut that one open today. Yeah. Um, I had leafy-footed beetles or something, leafy-footed something, and um, you can see how, like, dead everything's getting. It's totally decimated the melons. Yeah, it kind of sucks because it feels like every single time it's like, Ooh, something's, gonna be done something's starting yeah. to, yeah, something's starting to grow. We get excited and then it gets destroyed. Something starts to grow. We get excited and then it gets destroyed. And this is the same thing because yeah. the melons are like the last, well, I guess there's tomatoes. There's still some tomatoes. There's still some tomatoes happening, but for the most part, the melons are the last thing and we have a bunch of them starting and it won't even matter. Well, we have what, these two really big ones. Yes. Um, this one's a decent size over here that's growing in between the two pieces of fence. I just walked into a cup. <laughs> I don't know how. There's nothing There's nothing here. And then there's that one. Yes. That one. That one that's weirdly misshapen. Ugh. There's two right here on the hanging. And then there's two over on the other side. One's hanging, one's on the ground. Okay. Those are kind of the main ones I have. Yeah, the... Uh... I don't know how many of these we'll actually get, but we have this big one today. Okay. Well, I'm, uh, I hope that this is actually ready. <laughs> Bunk. Do you need me to get it? Can you get it? Here, give me the camera. I have the metal in my hand. Is it heavy? It is heavy. Good. That's a good sign. It's quite. What do you think? I don't know. I guess we'll see. <sighs> All right. All right. This is definitely a moment of truth. It is also very fragrant. So. Oh. It, has it happened? Has it occurred? It's sliced so easily. Let me get a spoon. Good? It's ripe. Is it? Mm hmm Well, time to spend a half hour chopping this. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. But hey, at least it's like, finally after all this time, there's- Do you wanna try it? Yeah, I definitely do. It's warm. I prefer it cold, so. Same, but yeah, that's sweet. Well, it's been sitting outside. Yeah, you did it though. You, Hooray, we got one. We got one. I realized I never mentioned yesterday, but you um, you'd went to the dermatologist mm -hmm. and you did have a mole removed. Yeah. First time in like years. Years. Yeah. So yeah. for people who don't know, melanoma runs in my family, my immediate family. So I get checked all the time. And so I had my yearly checkup and um, Every so often they're like, this one's concerning. So they'll take it and biopsy it and then decide if the biopsy will tell them if it is or not. Yeah. And I have had ones that are atypical precancerous. 
but they've been removed. And I haven't had any in a long time that they've been concerned about, but they took one yesterday. So at some point we'll get some information about that. Mm-hmm. Um, I will I will assume that it is fine, but yeah. if it is not, I'm sure we'll <laughs> talk about it. Um, and then today uh, you did more allergy shots. I know that yeah. you had had some trouble for a bit with the dosage, but it... Yeah, they had to drop me back to... The way my office works is they made four vials of my allergens and they start with this one and then they start like the dosages increase and then they go to this one, which is higher. And then this one, which is like full strength. And then this one is like a taper and it takes a long time to get through all of those. And I was starting on the first one and it, I was having side effects. So then they had to make me another vial and start me back at a sensitive track. So I have to go through the sensitive vial and then onto the regular ones. It's, you know... A work in progress. It's a work in progress. But while Mal was doing that, because they have to like hold her for half an hour, um, I was, I had, I had an errand to run and where I ran the errand, I was right next to a Whole Foods and I was like, I have some time to kill. I'm just going to walk in there. And I, I don't ever do any shopping at Whole Foods, but if I wind up at a Whole Foods, it's a little dangerous for me. Or a Wegmans. Wegmans is the same way. Don't shop at either of these places, but they both have cookie bars. And I am such a sucker for cookies. I love cookies so much. I don't know why. I I'm not, I feel like I'm really not a big sweets person, but man, when it comes to cookies, I will destroy some cookies. So I got I got I got some cookies today. I put some cookies in a box. There's like a little assortment here. Um I kind of know what some of them are. Uh, one, like these little things, they have names. I don't, ra- they start with an R. Uh, yeah. one of them is chocolate, but one of them's raspberry. Mm. And I wanted you to have the raspberry one. And there's also. The sugar cookie looks really good. There's also, um, like one of them's apple pie. I think this is apple pie. And then there's one that's like raspberry pie. So. Interesting. Yeah. Um, pick, pick anything out there. Is that the raspberry one? I think so. Okay, yeah, try try that. I have no idea what that's like. Good. Mm-hmm. Cool. Um, yeah. You want uh, the other half? Sure. I guess it'll give us a chance to like try it. It smells. It smells good. Oh, these were um, ultra fresh because I was picking out the cookies and then they brought the tray of these and I was like, I'll put one of those in the box. That's good, mm-hmm. but the raspberry's faint. It is. There's not enough raspberry. Mm-mm. Not at all. Mm-mm. You might have to dig. I am excited about the sugar cookie. Yeah, that's a. You said this one was apple pie. Um, that one looks like it has a raspberry. That's raspberry. I think this is apple pie. I'm pretty sure. Tell me if it tastes like an apple pie. Mm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Is it good? Mm-hmm. Good. <laughs> I'll take a small bite and you can have the rest if you want. Mmm. Crumbly. That one is very good. Mmm. That tastes like apple pie. Yeah, that's a really good one. Anyway, we're not going to sit here and eat all these right now. <laughs> oh, we're not? Probably. But yeah, I'm, I am I really love cookies. So anytime I'm in their stores, I'm like... Well, what if I go Apparently you can't be super unsupervised. I really can't. I really can't. It's fine. It's fine. I've had a lot going on lately, and I've been dealing with some things that I've managed to, you know, accomplish. And as a result, um, I think it's fine to reward oneself with a, a tiny box of cookies. I will cherish every bite of these because I love them. Anyway, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, let's meet back tomorrow. Ciao.